okay uh, if you know your ip of the particular uh, info way then what you have to do is you have to go to the browser and uh, and click that same ip uh, for example your ip is 192.168.0.100 uh, or whatever it is so click that particular ip and at the end you put colon 6161 so colon 6161 is the port you have to put that okay okay after putting colon 6161 you have to say enter and you will see an interface uh, something like this here you will see login you have to click that login and here you have to put the same username and password what you generally put for uh, login in mymilan app okay so when you sign in in your mymilan app you have a username and password a email id and a password i think so so that same username and password you have to put here and say login after just logging in inside this you will see a option called setting click that particular setting page uh, after that you can see at the right corner in the second option is patch update for info way okay so you have to click that patch update for info way remember full update you don't have to click the full update you have to click the patch update okay so click the patch update for info way and then initially you will see uh, something like this one is info way and the lighting will not be there initially in your case you will see only info way so at the right corner you can see a drop down arrow you have to click that and here will be a update option you have to update the info way first okay when you update the info way okay you can see that here it is updating okay it's downloading and and uh, the things are done okay now you can do one thing you can just refresh you can press f5 in your keyboard or after clicking here you can say enter okay this will refresh the particular page okay now you can see a lighting option okay so now the info way thing is gone there is a lighting option you can just again click here uh, and then you can see rf switch okay you have to click again the drop down from there and you can see again an update rf lighting update okay so click that update here you can see the update is going on the downloading thing is going on okay uh, now the things are updated and then that's all that's how we can just update the uh, controller as well as the the uh, patch for rf switch okay so after this your uh, rf socket or rf switch will work properly thank you